Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Isaac and today we will be building a function that determines if a number is prime or not. A prime number is a whole number greater than 1 whose two factors are 1 in itself. Let's get started. First thing we're going to do is create the function. We'll call it prime number. Then let's pass in the number. This parameter will represent it. Now, let's create a for loop. Let's go ahead and start this for loop uh, and uh, make i equal to 2. Because again, we don't want to start at 0. We're only concentrating on uh, prime numbers. So we'll make i uh, less than num. And we will increase uh, i by 1 increment each time. OK, uh, so now from here, we're going to make a conditional statement. And this uh, statement is going to say if uh, num, uh, using the modulus method, um, with i uh, has a remainder of 0, uh, then we're going to go ahead and return false. So basically, it's going to uh, return false if uh, the number is not prime. Uh, but if it is prime, we're going to go ahead and return true. Okay, so from here, uh, last thing we need to do is console log the result. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, pass in our parameter, and we'll pass in uh, 3. The reason we'll pass in 3 is because we know 3 is prime number. Let's go ahead and save that and uh, refresh our browser. Um, and as you can see, because it uh, is a prime number, it's going to go ahead and print out true in the console. Let's go ahead and let's throw in a number that is not prime to make sure this is working. So uh, we'll uh, pass in uh, 9. Okay, so go ahead and uh, refresh our browser. Uh, and as you can see, it's printed out false uh, due to the number uh, not being uh, prime. Uh, I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial today. Thank you.